tip on reinventing yourself is going to be stepping out of your comfort zone. You can't reinvent yourself if you tend to do the same. I keep saying it. If you do the same thing over and over, expecting different results is insanity, okay? You have to do different things. You have to try different things. You have to expand your horizon. You have to go new places, try new things, meet new people. Sometimes even just being... Um, even just meeting new people in different areas of your life is going to help you reinvent yourself because there's people, sorry, I'm trying to get cozy and comfy. There's people in your life that you're going to find that will help you reinvent yourself because you're meant to meet certain people for certain things. You're meant to meet certain people to teach you lessons, blessings. Um, you know, I believe in soul families, uh, soul tribes. Sometimes you're meant to meet meet people so that you can become a better version of yourself. Sometimes you're meant to meet people so that they, they can teach you a lesson. You know, sometimes you signed a soul contract with somebody and they're going to be here to, you know, teach you a lesson on, you know, how you can go about living life. You know what I mean? Um, but yeah, stepping out of your comfort zone is going to be a huge part when it comes to reinventing yourself. You can't be scared to do new things, try new things, or just, you know, being better. You have to be okay with change. You have to be okay with being uncomfortable. Being comfortable is not going to get you nowhere new. It's going to keep you in the same place, stuck, stagnant, and bored with life, honestly. Stepping out of your comfort zone it plays a huge part in that. Like, trying new things, even if you feel like it's going to fail, try it anyway, because why not? You know what I mean? Like you have to be okay with trying different things. You have to be okay with failing. Like we talked about before, be be comfortable with your failures because that's what's going to teach you the lessons that you need to know. Um, you can't be afraid to fail. If you're afraid to fail, you're not going to ever be successful because the most successful people did things that people called them crazy for. And now they're fucking millionaires. You know what I mean? There's businesses that people thought would never get off the ground, would never make it from little mom, uh, what is it? Mom and pop shop, whatever you want to call them. Millionaires, you know, it's people that if you look at the pictures of like the guy who started Amazon, the guy who started like, uh, what was the other one? Um, I forget what the other business was, but we're going to use the Amazon example. People probably thought that man was crazy. Look at that company now. Like, are you freaking like you, the proof is in a pudding. Okay. Like you have to be okay with looking crazy too. And part of getting out of your comfort zone is being okay with looking crazy because people are going to look at you like you're crazy, especially if you're doing something that's never been done before. If you're that creative and that unique to do something that's never been done before, people are going to look at you like you're crazy because it's never been done before. And you have to be okay with people looking at you that way because who else going to do it? You going to do it. Who else going to do it? If it's meant for you, be okay with looking crazy. No matter what it is, I will take that crazy to be a millionaire any day, depending on the crazy. Uh -huh. Okay. But I would take the crazy of being a millionaire. Like I would, I would, um, you have to push it. You have to push through the awkwardness of being cringe. Um, I used to feel like I was so cringe filming these videos. I don't give a fuck no more. Cause, cause what? Cause what? I'm sitting here talking to my camera and what? <laughs> Somebody going to watch it. And what I might look crazy sharing my YouTube videos to my Facebook and nobody's liking it or posting it. And what somebody's going to like it and post it. I might look crazy thinking that I'm going to be a millionaire, but, and what, but when I become a millionaire, then what, you know, like you cannot be afraid to look crazy, look crazy, be crazy, but you know what you are going to be successful, successful and crazy. And it's so crazy how, when you are trying to be successful, people, look at you like you're doing something wrong. They cringe at the things that you do, make you feel uncomfortable about following your truest purpose. Meanwhile, they're stuck stagnant in the same thing that they've been doing for the past 10 years. They're not trying anything new. You know what I mean? You can't be, be afraid of that. You like, especially, especially the family, the friends that 10 years down the line and they're still stuck in the same spot that they was in the same position. They don't have a say. They don't have a say Which you. The only thing that has a say in your potential and you, that's between you, God, you, the universe, whoever you pray to your higher power. Even it could be you versus you, honey. It don't got nothing to do with nobody else but you.